Alright guys, uh, welcome back to another video and today's video is not a Genjin Impact video actually as you can tell on the screen now and the title of this video it's actually regarding the new game that Mihoyo just announced is Honkai Star Rail so if you watched the Honkai Impact uh, online concert uh, recently uh, if you watched till the end of the concert did you notice they played a trailer uh, regarding this game so they actually announced the new this new game in the tr in the concert itself so you watch the concert then you already known by then so for those of you who didn't watch the concert so yeah they just actually announced this new game today and it's now available to actually sign up for closed beta eligibility so you can click on this uh, link here on your website i'll provide everything in the description so you can sign up here and fill up the survey and you're you're good to go so i've already done the survey so hopefully i get selected so i can try this game out and for more information on the beta, obviously you can click on this link and check out this uh, Hoyo Lab post. And as you can see, it starts today, and the end date currently is unknown. But uh, once they provide an updated date, I will provide the date in the description below as well, so you can take a look at that. And the interesting thing is that the beta is available on PC platform and also on iOS. So this means this confirms that this game also will have a PC client on launch. Looks like. So it's something like Gadget Impact where they have a PC client on launch and also a mobile one and also on PlayStation. But uh, currently for beta testing, it looks like only PC and iOS it seems. There's, like, there's no Android or other platforms it seems for this beta testing. But anyway, that's all the information we got. And the requirements on PC actually aren't that high. So this game is not very intensive like uh, Gadget Impact. So you just require an i5 processor it says, HB of RAM. A discrete graphics card with a GTX 970 or better, so it's not very demanding like Genshin Impact. So it's a pretty light, light game. But if you don't have much information on like what engine it uses or uh, what kind of API users, so very still not much information on that. But it just they just unveiled it, so this is the only info we got. So from this website, you can take a look at the characters that they gonna uh, release with the game. So currently we only have like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 characters in the game and for the first one here you can see we have Himiko so this is not a new thing if you played Honkai Impact you will know this character she's from there so it looks like they bring in that bring her to this game as well and these are her story and the interesting thing is we have an English VA now so that's good to, that's good to see and obviously JP will be the same one same vo uh, voice actor uh, for this character I think it's a new one well I don't know about this character, looks like it's a new one. And this one, Dan Heng. Okay, this one is also a new character. I don't remember this in Honkai. Um, this one as well. So, a lot of new characters come into the game that we don't know, which is cool. This really looks like Child <laughs> in Genshin Impact a bit, kind of. Uh, and I think this looks like Zhongli, <laughs> kind of as well. Anyway, this one is Sealy. So, Sealy is not a new character as well. This is uh, also brought over from Honkai Impact. So some of them are not new. And last second last one is Clara, looks like also a new character. And lastly Esther. So you can check all this in the website as well. I'll provide a link description for more information on their story and background and so on. So these are the eight characters that we got so far. Now let's take a look at some of the gameplay information that we got on the website. So not much actually, we only know it's a new title to the Honkai series, okay. Uh, it's the turn-based RPG, so we need to plan out and strategize with in terms of the team setup and builds, I guess. So you can see we have like, we can have an energy or something, you can see there's like an energy thing over here, it's something like Genshin, and we have a buff here, so it's really something like Genshin a bit, but it's turn-based, so you can see we have to take turns to attack uh, the enemy. So pretty interesting game, if you like turn-based RPG, this could be the game for you maybe. Uh, we also got some dungeon exploration here, you can see. So it's, I think it's like a domain in Genshin when you just go inside the level and you just fight enemies and or just find some uh, chests or something maybe. So pretty interesting to see that as well. And we also got, uh, this is just superb graphics and sound so I believe it's gonna have a very nice uh, graphics in, in the game and good soundtracks. Uh, I'm really not sure what the engine is using, I said I, I think it's the same engine maybe, it's a Unity engine. But we have to find out once the game uh, launches and take a look at that. And that's it. So that's all the information we got from this uh, website. So it just shows us the basic information on the gameplay, uh, the characters, and also uh, just the homepage and to sign up for the beta. So that's pretty much it actually for the uh, initial look 
for of Honkai Star Rail. We don't have much information. Actually, we need to actually uh, play the game to find out more. I hope I get the beta so I can show to you guys the footage of the game. Uh, if they allow so, but if they don't allow, then ah, uh, never mind. But if they do allow us to show the footage of the game, I will obviously share to you guys. But if they don't, then we probably just have to wait for the full release of this game and then we'll give it a shot. And uh, yeah, all the social media platforms are on top here. They have a Reddit, Twitter, YouTube, Instagram, Hoyo Lab, and Discord. So all the links I'll provide in the description below for all your uh, social media platforms. So you can check that out. So you can check it out as well. So guys, that's pretty much it for this video. Just to give you guys an uh, overview of the new Honkai Star Wars game that's been unveiled by Mihoyu. So this is actually pretty exciting and it's a very different game. It will be different very different compared to Genshin Impact and Honkai Impact so this is not like an open world kind of game it's a turn based RPG so it's a totally different game it should be very mobile friendly uh, because uh, it doesn't, doesn't really require you to explore much because it's just a turn based RPG but we'll see once it launches uh, what are they gonna show us in this game and yeah can't wait I'll be hopefully I'll get selected and I can try this game out and give you guys my initial impression of the game and if it's good, then I'll probably cover this game as well alongside uh, my main game, which is Genshin Impact as well. So guys, thank you guys for watching, guys, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.